Hey there, it's your healthy housewife, Marcia Prince here. And today's exercise involves a compound movement using the kettlebell. Now we're gonna do a compound movement is a series of a couple different exercises using a few different muscle groups. In this particular exercise, we'll be doing a frontal shoulder raise and a plie squat combined. And with any exercise, you wanna make sure your core is tight. Always think belly button to the spine. Make sure you draw that in because the core is the foundation to any exercise, okay? You wanna make sure you have proper form. All right, so let me begin by picking up the kettlebell and I can instruct the exercise. Okay, with you pick up, when you pick up anything heavy, make sure your core is tight like I just talked about. Use your legs, not your back. Okay, to get in position, we wanna make sure our feet are about maybe three feet apart and also make sure your feet are pointed at a 45 degree angle. If this was, if you're instead of facing front or to the side, try to angle it to a 45 degree because we really wanna use that inner thigh. All right, so we're gonna get in position. We're gonna come down into a plie squat. At the same time, we're going to raise the kettlebell. So here we go. We're coming down. Bring it up, hold, and up, just like that. So come down, contract the glutes and the shoulders, and come back up. Here we go. No swinging, just slow controlled movement. Make sure you're contracting and up. And with any exercise, when it's compound movement, the heart rate gets up. As you can hear, I'm getting a little bit winded using both of these exercises together. There you go. All right, so that's the kettlebell compound movement. 